Today we're going to be looking at polynomials. First we're going to be finding the degree and the number of terms of a polynomial. The first polynomial we're given is 5x squared plus 2x minus 5. How you find the degree of a polynomial is to look at the highest power of the variable. In this case it's x squared, so the degree of this polynomial is 2. When you're looking at terms, here's one term, here's another, and here's another one. So this is degree of 2, and it has three terms. Looking at the next polynomial, we see that the highest power is x cubed, so the degree of this polynomial is 3. When we're counting terms, there's one there, one there, one there, and the fourth one is here. So this polynomial has a degree of 3 and 4 terms. When we're evaluating polynomials, we're substituting whatever value we're given. In this case, we're given y equals 4. So we take this polynomial and substitute 4 in for y. 4 squared we know is 16, and 3 times 16 is 48. We still have minus 5, and 48 minus 5 is 43. So this polynomial evaluated when y equals 4 is 43. Moving on, the next polynomial is our negative 9x cubed minus x squared plus 4x minus 7. And they want us to evaluate it when x equals 2. Once again, we just substitute that 2 in for x, and we have 2 cubed, which we know is 8. We have a negative 9 times that 8 for a negative 72. We have 2 squared and a negative sitting out in front of it, which makes it a negative 4. And then we have plus 4 times 2, which is a positive 8. And we still have our negative 7. Negative 9 times 8 is that 72 again, so we have a negative 72 minus 4 plus 8 minus 7. And that is a negative 75. So this polynomial evaluated when x equals 2 is a negative 75. We're going to simplify by adding like terms. We see here's an x cubed and here's another x cubed. This one is a negative 2 and this is a negative 1 for a total of a negative 3x cubed. We have a positive 5x minus 9x for a total of a negative 4x. Looking at the next polynomial, we see that there is a negative x to the fourth minus six more x to the fourth for a total of negative seven x to the fourth. Then we look for our x's and there's plus two here, plus eight there for a total of 10x. We have a positive three minus seven, which is a negative four. So when we combined all these like terms, we ended up with a negative 7x to the 4th, plus 10x minus 4. Continuing to add like terms, we have 2mn minus 5mn, which is a negative 3mn. We have plus 8m plus 7m for a total of plus 15m. And we still had that negative 10 in.